Well, I'm packing up my game and I'm going head out west Where real women come equipped with scripts and fake press Find a nest in the hills, chill like Flint Buy an old drop top, find a spot to pimp Then I'm a kid, rock it up and down your block Hey everybody, had a lot of documents to pour through, a lot of reading And, well, I'm just going to start off with uh, There is a lot of stuff that is going on with this company, Uranium One. There cannot be any doubt of that. There is absolute proof that the Clinton Foundation was receiving donations from this company, Uranium One, and from the Russians. It's just so interesting that there's a lot of uranium in Oregon. Uranium One has uh, projects going on in Wyoming. And, well... Why aren't they trying to get into Oregon then? Are they indeed trying to get into Oregon? Is there evidence that our very own government is using tactics against the people in Oregon to get them to move? Well, there is evidence that they are doing that, but it's just circumstantial that it involves the state of Oregon. It is interesting that all of the events that we see taking place with the BLM or Fish and Wildlife Service, just so happens to be in the western states where we're finding a lot of resources, mineral resources. And as you will see right here, one of the things that are, the charges are being leveled against the Clinton Foundation is this. But there is certainly a circumstantial case. Exhibit A for Mrs. Clinton, uranium you know the stuff we use for nuclear energy and bombs you might imagine it's a hot commodity and guess who has a fair amount of it we do the united states of america but thanks to a deal in, approved in part by mrs clinton's state department we no longer control at least one-fifth of our capacity perhaps more instead the russians do concerned about the federal government trying to get some its hands on some land out west even trying to get some its hands on some land out west did you hear that said plain and clear the government getting its hands on lands out west but where out west and what for it's one out of every three acres in america and disproportionately in the west they still want to buy more land they want to control private property around it and they want to do it if even if congress does not okay it they want to control the land out west and they want to control private land. Get it? Private land? So they are creating these situations where it's forcing ranchers to shut down. We've seen it. We've actually saw an attack on the Hammond Ranch because they wanted that ranch so bad. Well, I'm going to show you some documents here. And um, I'm not going to commentary all the way through this or probably not going to commentary at all i am just going to let the documents speak for themselves i want to kind of give you an idea of what some of the at least one of the acronyms that are important here in case you don't know what rmp for the blm or the wildlife service stands for stands for resource management plan let us now get to it.